Okay guys, so today we are testing the, um, the bridge. Um, this retro is going to pass over the bridge. It's the first time I think something as heavy as this is passing over. So um, we'll see if this bridge can hold up some stuff. So far so good. Me and my wife are on it as well. So if something happens, you guys will, uh, I don't know if you'll see this video, but you will see the video if the phone doesn't get damaged. Uh, we're over, so thank God. The bridge can handle it. We're good. Let's get work done. God will grant us victory in 2023. So let's go. Good day guys, welcome back to Back to Eden Lifestyle. Um, today, I just wanted to give you guys an update. I know you guys haven't been hearing a lot from us recently, but uh, we'll try to start to do better now. Um, we have been extremely busy uh, planning so many different things. As you know, the last update I think I gave you guys is that we had a problem with the landslide. That was the last rainy season. Right now, dry season has started and the work has continued and we're trying to solve that problem um, right now as we speak. So I just wanted to give you guys an update as to what that looks like. Um, as we told you the last time, we needed to do a, a wall, a retaining wall for the, uh, the landslide that took place. As you can see here, a, a lot of rocks um, were delivered. We have this retro working. Um, but we also already did a lot of work over here. So let me, um, let me run over here. I have my wife run with me. Uh, um, so what, are we, what did we do? We built a gaviones, they call it gaviones wall, rock wall. Uh, right now it's three layers, um, but we will be finishing off with a fourth, uh, fourth row as well. So we'll have a big uh, rock wall right over here. And uh, we just wanted to thank God for helping us so, so far. Everything you see happening here is just by the grace of God. Um, and by your kind donations and help. We have uh, been helped and donate, uh, donated the funds to be able to uh, do this uh, wall. And soon enough, we will be continuing with some, um, um, with some other work over the bridge, which we are preparing right now. Let me just walk or run up here quickly so you guys can see how cool this really is oi this is the rock wall so you guys um, hopefully you can visit us soon and be a live witness as to god's goodness and his grace he has uh, even though the enemy tried to set us back uh, we are able to find a solution for it and keep praying that when the rainy season comes that this solution is the solution and that we would have no other problems with, uh, with landslides. We're, um, we're intending to beautify this area as well. Um, so whenever you are visiting, um, this should even look uh, even prettier than it already is. So um, let me just go over to the other side because we have some work happening um, right there as we speak. And uh, so I can give you guys an update as to what is supposed to take place and what you can expect from us during this dry season. So let's go over the bridge. The bridge is old news by now, but I'm still every day I pass over it. I'm so excited and happy because this bridge of itself is a miracle. Um, so um, over on the other side, the intention is that we build uh, one of our first structures on the property and we have a, a brother from, uh, from the church right now, busy for us, um, who is going to lay out um, the area for uh, the retro to come to dig the foundation of our first structure here on the property. So God is good and we're excited about that. As you uh, guys uh, can see over there, um, you see a vehicle, but then you'll also see our brother 
who is uh, busy uh, working. And uh, right now we're waiting on the retro uh, guy to come to start the excavation and uh, I'm preparing the area for the pouring of the foundation. So um, right over there is, uh, is John and, uh, and the equipment for that. Also something that we're planning on doing. So we are building a shed here. Um, which is a workplace and where we can store materials so that as we build um, we have at least a, a dry area that we can put stuff and also that when we're here working on the property we at least have an area that people can use the bathroom or find some a shelter when it rains because nine months of rain uh, you need something like that over on this side um, um, we have excavated this area we have made a loop uh, around and uh, we're planning on uh, putting two, what we call here, carillas, two lanes, um, going all the way around and coming back uh, down on the other side. So that's the work we want to happen, uh, want to take place in this uh, dry season um, so that we can uh, actually start construction of some other um, um, structures on the first level. So there's a lot happening in this, um, in this dry season also something else that i want to inform you guys about we're also hosting our first um a campaign uh, back to eden lifestyle is running a campaign as a health fair plus we have an international speaker coming down um uh, to visit us here in panama and um we have the information that we're going to post uh, in this post as well. So if you have people here in Panama, in Panama City or wherever, share it with them. It will be from the 5th of February to the 11th of February. And we have no one else than the forerunner. Uh, Christopher Hudson himself will be over here uh, presenting uh, God's uh, truth for this time. And uh, we will be doing a health fair. So there's a lot happening with the ministry right now. And we would like to keep, thank you for helping us with your donations, with your encouragements. Please keep us in prayer. Uh, may God continue to bless you. And whatever you see us doing, you can do it as well through the grace and power of Jesus Christ. Only by the grace and power of Jesus Christ. We thank you for looking at this, watching at this video. Share, like, and uh, if, you're, if you're able and you're here in Panama, come out and visit us. We love you. Until the next time.